Welcome ZDrop dropshippers. Today we are going to go over two features that ZDrop has provided. One is branding your product images as well as going over quick messages. Please go to ZDrop.com where you can sign up for free. You get seven day trial and then after that it is $16.99 per month. You can find all of the information here on our website. Once you have signed up for ZDrop, go ahead and go into your dashboard. Go ahead and download your Chrome extension. You can either click on it here or you can go to the Chrome web store where you can find both the ZDrop extension and the ZDrop quick messages. Now let's go back into our dashboard. What you want to do to brand your product images is head over to the top right hand corner. This right here where it says seller, there's a little drop down menu. Click on profile and it'll take you to this right here, this page. Okay. Now I have two shops, so I purposely put this as my other logo. I'm going to change it for you guys so you can see how it works. Now, as long as you get this drop down box here, this notification that says it's been uploaded successfully, hit OK, hit refresh. And as you can see, now they're the same. The difference between both of these is one is an icon that is added to your product images when you list the item on Facebook, and the other one is an overlay. And I'll show you what I mean here shortly but let's double check to make sure that it worked. So go ahead and go to your ZDrop extension. Click on settings. All right, and I set up a template for this. I highly recommend it for maximum optimization of the software and for your dropshipping experience, okay? And as you can see here, both the overlay and the image upload is ready to go. It tells me that it's set. And now I can show you what that looks like on the back end. So go ahead and choose whatever retailer that you are gonna use. I chose Banggood and I'm gonna click Copy by ZDrop after I find the product that I want. Now by automatically clicking Copy by ZDrop, it does open up a separate window to Facebook Marketplace where I can list the item for sale. All right, so now we got our red box that showed up and this here, paste data, go ahead and click on that. And we'll just give it a second. All right, so now you can see that it's copied over all of the information, images, title, description. These icons here, this is your overlay in the bottom right hand corner with your brand as well as an image at the end. This feature is a great way to really bring brand awareness and consistency to your shop. Okay, now that we have covered how to brand your product images, we are gonna talk about quick messages. So if you haven't already, go ahead and open up your Facebook and then go ahead and go to Messenger and then see all in Messenger. Okay. And let's go ahead and go into ZDrop. Quick messages. If you need to create your own template of a message, just go ahead and type in the name of your message and then what you want your script to be, click save. I've already done a couple, so I'm going to choose this one right here. I'm going to click save. I'm going to go ahead and go back into Facebook to refresh my screen. And there you have it. This little box up here will pop up and whatever person you're talking to will receive this message. And I'll show you what that looks like. I'm going to go ahead and choose a message right here. It automatically pops down to the bottom box where you would usually type your message and then automatically sends it for you. That's how you can quickly respond to your customers with ZDrop quick messages. If you guys 
need to stay updated or view more tutorials, please head over to zdrop.com. Thank you again for watching and we will see you guys next time.